have you spent the off season? Uh, I spent the, the off season just really trying to, you know, focus on getting my body in the best shape as possible, and uh, just trying to keep my weight that I finished the season at last year. You know, coming into camp this year. Where were you at this um, Like location wise, mm -hmm. uh, I spent a lot of time back home in Chicago, really with family, and then uh, you know out here maybe like one to two weeks a month. So you really just Chicago, Utah, and then I, a little bit of LA sometimes too. So. What did that run at the end of the year with you being the starter do for your confidence heading into the summer? Uh, it just lets you, you know, know where, where you could be and uh, just it gives you somewhere, you know, to measure from. So just being able to have that was great for me. What was your playing weight at the end of last year and where are you now? I was around like two, like 39, 240. Okay. So uh, now I, I weighed yesterday, I was like 240. So it's really good. What I mean, uh, Will kind of talked about this being kind of an all-out battle for this point guard spot and guard time in general, right, with the, you guys have a ton of talent at, at the guard position. How do you approach that, and kind of how do you look forward to training camp knowing that kind of minutes are, are up for grabs a little bit? Uh, just you got to go into it ready and prepare to, you know, compete every day. Um, you know, I feel like I wouldn't want it any other way. Uh, playing with the group that we have and the group of guys that we have, it's, it's going to be very, very competitive, especially with – you know, the guards that we have. So just being able to, to compete against them is going to be is going to be great for us during the season, for all of us. I mean, LA, you played to compliment when you beat LeBron, right? Mm -hmm. but, and then last year you got kind of unleashed, right? You didn't play. So what did you learn about yourself and, and what you're capable of? Uh, I just learned that, you know, going through what I went through my first three years in the NBA uh, kind of prepared me just to be able to get the opportunity. So just uh, really just trying to make the most of it when I get those opportunities. You picked up the option, obviously, to stay here. Kind of what was the thinking and what went into that decision? Uh, just, you know, being here was, like, perfect. You know, the situation was, you know, I felt like it was great for me. So always coming back to it, you know, being comfortable with the coaches, being comfortable with everybody was, you know, a big factor in it. And then, you know, just obviously always wanted to, you know, I'm not going to leave anything on the table. So just being able to do that was good. Statistically, your assist rate is really high. Traditionally, when someone's not a natural point guard, when they play point guard, that's actually the one thing that doesn't happen. So what allowed you to have a particularly high assist rate and be able to add that into your game while taking that role? Uh, just the guys that I'm playing with, obviously. Just you know, having Walker, especially at the end of the year, Walker, Lowry, KO, and Ochai in it most of the time, and then having you know Colin come back and JC seeing those guys play. Obviously, just you know, if you got guys like that, it's, it's going to be almost easy to get assists. So just being a willing passer is kind of the the way I went about thinking going into the season. So, you know, I'm just trying to do that again. Did you get to see the floor with John Collins much during open gym? And if so, what did you see? Uh, not much, but obviously I, we already know, like, you know, the type of player that he is, you know, super electrifying and, you know, athletic and a great roller and also space the floor. So just being around somebody like that, you know, gives you another weapon on the offensive side. So. What did your success this season going to come down to? Uh, my view, just making the right reads, uh, you know, just getting better with my decision making and then just trying to become more efficient. So, so just coming down to that and then staying in shape throughout the season and staying healthy.